Well, I'd like to thank everyone for coming out today. It's been great to uh, be with you for the last few days talking about how we'll take action. You know, today Congressman McMahon has an opportunity to show leadership on a seminal issue of our time and one that matters to our personal security. He has an opportunity to stand up to the Obama administration, to Nancy Pelosi, to the public employees unions that are bankrupting this city, this state, and this country. And perhaps most importantly, he has an opportunity to stand for his constituents here on Staten Island and of course over in Brooklyn. H.R. 4972 is a bill sponsored by Stephen King, Republican of Iowa. It's called a discharge petition. And this discharge petition aims for a straight up and down vote on repealing Obamacare. We can all agree that this city and this state and this country cannot afford this bill. Now this should be a no-brainer for the congressman. He voted against the bill. But as you and I know, he did so in the 11th hour, largely in the shadows. If he truly wants to lead, he will not only sign this petition, but urge the 33 other Democrats who voted against that bill to sign it as well. An up or down vote is all we ask. This discharge petition will help restore funding to our local hospitals. The reason that Congressman McMahon gave for why he voted against the bill initially. The numbers are impressive. By repealing Obamacare, we can bring $25 million back to Rumsey, $45 million back to Staten Island University Hospital, up to $112 million to Maimonides Medical Center over in Brooklyn, and up to $70 million back to Lutheran Medical Center. As I said, this should be a no-brainer. I'm going to walk over to the congressman's office now and deliver him a letter urging him on behalf of citizens in his district and in this country to finally show real leadership, to take a stand and move out of the middle of the road and onto one side of this debate. Thanks for being here today and let's hope our congressman stands for us and not for the special interests. The letter has been delivered. Yeah!